The proposal to relocate University High School to Catalina came as a big blindside to many, including Jennifer Dillon. We were just like, what is going on? Dillon graduated from Catalina in 1999. Her daughter, a sophomore, is also a Trojan. TUSD governing board member Mark Stegeman says Catalina High administration was notified of what the proposal would entail at least four days before the presentation. The most important point is to say that this is only a proposal. It has not really gone through the process yet. The UHS Rincon campus is filled with an excess of 2,200 students and a facility built for 2,000. This has resulted in overcrowding and little to no room for growth and enrollment. Catalina High was designed to accommodate 1,500 students. Right now, it has over 700. Stegeman says the proposal bodes well for all schools involved, especially Catalina. The Catalina students can get a better, more educational options, more support in a school of 1,800 than in a school that's under 800. Dylan is concerned about potential transportation barriers and losing the tight-knit community feel. And if they move to Rincon, will they lose that closeness and that bond because they'll have to emerge with more students that they haven't grown with. The TUSD Governing Board has requested a follow-up report to include a desegregation analysis and look at the impacts on athletics and arts, among other issues. Zach Briggs, News for Tucson. Developing in Phoenix, next Monday, police